CBS The Young and the Restless Spoilers updates Friday, October 8th. Full episodes wine our revealers for Wednesday, October 6th. Billy found out some important Ashland secrets of Nick. That influence with tour's mind make her feel like herself. And I need to be more careful, or maybe it's another secret. The man has a lot, plus Nate Hastings and Ella Dawson tell a few lies, and not even about themselves. Ashlyn promised Victoria that he would be honest about everything, but the past 60 years was too long for him to cover it all at once. Just talking about the events that he felt were important to him, yes, but Victoria said he was lying and was hiding something. Then he said, get ready, I'm going to tell you everything. Did I mention how hard it is for me to tell you everything? Look at my face. Everything will be clear, and Victoria should open her mind and realize this. Billy will tell Victoria everything, but Ashlyn will confess first. There's a story about poor boy Bobby being abused, and poor boy Bobby being abused let his best friend die and took over the story of his identity. That was Ashlyn. He was and didn't want to live with his unlucky name Bobby anymore. So he took the identity of Ashlyn, locked when he died, and lived with his name. It brought much luck and convenience to Bobby. Victoria is sympathetic to this poor story, and she will help Ashlyn overcome her fear. And she does not want her husband to be hurt by repeating the sad story. He's not wrong. Every time Ashlyn claims he's revealed everything, there's always something more. Billy hates Ashlyn's personality. Every time he meets, there's something wrong. And Ashlyn claims he's revealed everything, and there's always something more. Billy hates Ashlyn's personality every time he meets a problem. He often tells a story to deceive the opposite person. For the sake of children, this has nothing to do with Billy's feelings for Victoria. Nate helped Ashlyn through the side effects of chemotherapy, and now they are best friends. Nate and Elena come to Italy on a mission to protect and take good care of this patient's health. And a few lies. And Nate doesn't understand how complicated things are going. But he says his job is just to take care of the patients. He did not participate in anyone's personal feud. And she did not belong to the Newman or Locke family. Abby's decided to let Dominic wean. And needs to live with his own, on his own formula. And Mariah doesn't have a positive attitude when it comes to pumping him. So they're about to have a fight. And that doesn't make Mariah feel bad, does it? Abby didn't want to be bothered by Mariah's selfishness anymore, and Abby will announce that she doesn't need any more milk, hoping that Mariah will understand. Devin will connect Abby and Mariah, saving them to the trouble, and they don't need Mariah's help, and Mariah tells Tessa she can't leave town while Bowie is sick. Mariah and Tessa still have not found a common voice. Both are very stubborn, and no one will accept anyone's thoughts.